And we begin on this bright note as the award season in channels television continues as the chairman, CEO, Mr. John Momo, became the recipient of the Constituency for Africa's Excellence in Journalism Award as part of the year's Ronald H. Brown African Affairs Series. The award was presented at a stakeholder's dinner where the African-American community got to learn more about the organization. Our correspondent Amarachi Ubani reports. For eight times, Channel Television has been awarded Best Television Station in Nigeria. And in March this year, was declared Best TV Station in Africa at the 2014 African Achievers Awards in Accra, Ghana. Well, the winning has not stopped. The station's accomplishments in maintaining the highest standards in broadcasting and reliable news reportage have been recognized in faraway United States. Last week, Mr. Momo was invited by the Constituency for Africa, a group of concerned individuals on the affairs of the continent, to be guest speaker at this year's Ronald H. Brown series on African affairs. We need to convert our numerous communities into information-rich ones. Major educational institutions, including junior level and high schools, as well as colleges, colleges and universities throughout the sub-Saharan Africa and the African diaspora would benefit from a television service that promotes an African orientation, an inspiring and meaningful public service television broadcasting revolution could be launched by introducing a dedicated series of African heritage television through which a culture of developing civil society groupings will gradually evolve. And then the main reason he was invited by the CFA. Mr. Momo is presented with the award for media excellence. John Momo Outstanding Journalism in Africa Award. John uh, Olachi Momo, O-O-N. Chair and CEO of Channels Television Nigeria in recognition of your outstanding efforts toward the promotion of media outreach and journalistic excellence on the African continent. Which he receives accompanied by his lovely wife, the <laughs> Vice Chairman of Channels Television, Mrs. Shola Momo, and a few management staff. I must say that I accept it with so much joy and this is one of the best awards that I've ever received. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A goldfish indeed has no hiding place. CFA members have been monitoring Mr. Thank Momo you. and Channel's television's progress since its inception. Anytime you go to Nigeria, I mean, I could be blowing smoke tonight, but if you go, just turn on the television. And you'll see what 30 plus years of experience and commitment has done to promote a greater and more diverse and a stronger democracy in Nigeria. Others, uh, impressed by the success uh, story, the want channels television to produce content for the African American community, which will be broadcast on local networks and even in schools and in colleges. We've got the deans of the schools of communication who are interested. They have television stations, they have radio stations. And I'm just going to put that out there to say that there could probably be some very profitable conversations about hooking them into uh, a global strategy. A lot of these international events you always see Africa, questions about Africa not being asked by Africans and certainly not being asked in a positive manner. So we need the African media to be part of the establishment press corps here on the ground. I'm just going to suggest um, uh, that through your vehicle that we have like a weekly program where you can expose the good works of the African diaspora. So we're doing some good things out here, all over. And people need to know it in Nigeria, and I know because they appreciated George Jefferson and his cleaning <laughs> business, that they're gonna appreciate all the stuff Mel is gonna bring to you. Mr. John Momo attributes his success to God, the companionship of his lovely wife, and persistence and commitment to doing what is right. Those of us at the station say, May the accolades keep coming.
Amarachi Ubani, reporting for Channel Television News.